Walker, the family of a Long Beach honor student, is speaking out tonight following a shooting that killed the 16-year-old on homecoming night. Long Beach detectives say she was caught in the crossfire Friday night next to Wilson Classical High School on 10th Street and Zemino Avenue. New Central's Rachel Kim has more. 16 yellow balloons representing each year of Melody Ross's life fly near the spot where her life was taken. We feel like we've been robbed. Ross's family grieving with so many others who brought colorful expressions of sympathy just outside Woodrow Wilson High School in Long Beach. She always had a smile on her face. She always was, you know, bringing people up when they were down. She just had this spirit that never went away. The 16-year-old junior had just left the school's homecoming football game Friday night along with hundreds of other students. A dispute then broke out nearby and a gunman fired into the crowd, hitting Ross and two others. Ross, a star student and athlete, lost her life. Older sister Emily is still numb. Do you think it's sunk in yet, Emily? No. I think it hasn't yet. I, it will soon enough. Ross's uncle tells News Central her family came to the U.S. after escaping the Cambodian killing fields. Her parents had high hopes for their daughter who was born here. Today, the messages of love that couldn't fit on these boards spilled over onto the sidewalk. It means a lot. It shows that a lot of people do care about it and that she really was special. Long Beach police are asking for the public's help in finding the shooter. They hope students who may have been taking pictures or shooting video that night will call them. We know she's in heaven. You know, but it just, it was too soon, you know. She's only 16. Counselors and psychologists will be here at the school tomorrow to help students deal with their loss. As for the two other people who were shot, they suffered non-life-threatening injuries. Reporting in Long Beach, Rachel Kim, New Central.